Your girl is a tourist son. Damn. I love what I do. Somebody say it for me. Y'all ready to do me I'm tap the fuck in. Tap the fuck in. Tap the fuck in. Okay. Hello, Taurus. Welcome, gang. Your girl is a Taurus son. Be mindful to flip and switch any masculine and feminine energies. Take what resonates only from the multiple scenarios that will come out in this collective Taurus reading thank you for your support in whichever way you choose to do that i am very grateful anything you need to know about me will be in the description box today we're going to see what is your person thinking where do they stand how do they feel for taurus angels spirit guides ancestors where does that person stand for taurus i want to make amends your person is in the energy of righting their wrongs wanting to work it out or this is you towards them be mindful to flip and switch your feelings versus you knowing that it is not you. For Taurus, because your person could be cross-watching. Will you ever make things right? See, now, with this being said, two of you could be mirroring each other, or this is a cross-watching moment. I want to make amends. Will you ever make things right? Or the both of you definitely could have done something to jeopardize or to halt y'all's connection. I'm going to get a clarification with a tarot card moving forward what else for Taurus? i compare you to others can't compete where you don't compare god damn it but uh this is a situation where i feel your person is starting to see how you stand out amongst others uh because they could be dating or involved or married to very toxic low vibrational un uh i want to say people who are unmotivated cannot create or do in their lives here um i just see someone comparing you to the people that they're encountering because what i want to make it make amends and will you make things right they could have went another way with i want to make amends or you could have what will you ever make things right they're asking you either way wherever you or them went y'all are comparing others to one another what else for tourists I am recovering. So you or your person is also going through a healing phase. I don't know how to feel. Some of you, your person is uh, definitely going through, uh, I want to say some emotional transformations here. What I'm recovering and don't know how to feel. There could have been some kind of damage in you all's connection. Cut the deck on. I knew exactly what I was doing. So someone definitely purposely chose to do whatever they did here that they want to make amends about. I love you unconditionally on the other side. For Taurus, what's the tea? Just being near you is intoxicating. So either this is a toxic connection because I I am beginning to share and spread. If you, th if you think about it and look all the way around the world, not every Taurus is in a high vibrational state. So yeah, there could be some toxicity in between some connections for some of you. But for some of you, there's a strong kinetic kinetic chemistry between the two of you what else from Taurus is person I left you before you could leave me this is one of the things they want to make amends about with I don't know how to feel they could have pushed you away or sabotaged you all's connection or this is you you could have done this to your person but someone could have pushed you away because they were needing to heal with I am recovering again I'm going to get a tarot just speaking on what I feel but um, it all makes sense with some tarot cards come out. I left you before you could leave me. I'm recovering. They weren't healed when you all began to date or uh, got married or whatever type of involvement it was. They were not yet healed. What else for Taurus? Oh, this is you. You could have pushed someone away too. Or just could have been a very uh, toxic connection. And there is that just being near you is intoxicating. But somebody missed that. I want to feel that way again. So... I'm picking up on a strange connection here. Some of you could be missing a karmic partner or two with this uh, wanting to feel that way again with some. Yeah, because it's, it's time for me to heal now. Some of you could be missing a, a karmic partner here. I stay awake thinking about you. I hear who I really am. Yeah, some of you were dating the devil in disguise. Okay. Or your person was. Either way, some of you, that was a connection here where you feel sort of kind of called to. Or uh, just being by yourself doesn't really go well for you. 
But this could also be as simple as missing a connection that was worth missing. I am not ready, though, for a lot of you. Someone is not healed. They don't know how to feel. They need to heal. And uh, they pushed you away. Y'all more than likely got stuck at toxicity or romantic encounters. Can we start over for those that are dealing with someone who wants to make amends? So, yes multiple scenarios what else for tourists from that person there was someone interfering in our relationship could have been a third party a mister or a mistress a baby mama or a baby daddy or a husband or a wife with a third party folk or someone doing spell work because you don't want them or your person does not want them for tourists what else from that person This is the end for some of you. Now, this card could speak of them world carding, closing out a cycle with someone else. Okay, for some of you, you finally close out a cycle with a karmic partner of your own. You need to, you need to if you have not, with I am recovering, going through some healing phases. For some of you, you and your person have reached the end of you all's dealing with each other. Because it may be toxic, like I said. Not every tourist on the planet is a good person. What else? I feel empty without you. For some of you, your person is missing you deeply. They could be needing to heal. Yeah, with I don't know how to feel, they could definitely not know how to feel because you could have cut them off. You could have went cold. You could have stopped giving to this connection. What else for Taurus? That flipped in reverse. I'm not ready. Oh, shit. Well, then. I retract my statement for those that are dealing with somebody who needs to heal. They say that they're going to do what it takes to get ready. Probably more than likely coming out right after I feel empty without you. Your existence has now shifted. So they have to shift as well. What else for Taurus? One more. Any placement. Sideways, I check on you from afar. Some of you could have shut down your social media or you stopped posting. There's nothing for them to look at. Or you don't do as much as you used to on social media. You are the person of my dreams. For some of you checking on you from afar, you could have moved or you moved closer. There's no need to check. There's nothing to look into because you could be dealing with your person. Okay, let's get some terror out here to make it make sense. For Taurus beginning with i want to make amends there's that star card <laughs> healing some of you are dealing with an aquarius some of you could be chosen in the spotlight there could be a choice between a toxic connection and a very healing one what will be decided some of you your person owes you an apology they know that they're in love with you full card this is how they start over by simply apologizing let's see Some of them could be married. This could be you with the uh, King of Pentacles. Here's the King of Wands for some of you. For some of you, men, this is you. Ready to take action now that you have your stability where it needs to be. Could be a father. Could travel for work. Or could just be very magnetic, life of the party. Okay. Uh, taking the initiative. Wanting to be a provider. Wanting to do what it takes to bring a stable foundation to a home. For you. Or uh, this is you towards them. I want to make amends for Taurus's person. Because they ghosted you. Or they pulled back. Or they have went within. Introspection. Searching for answers. They know that this is the, this is the way to go. The hermit is someone who pulls back. Ghosts. Go into solitude. Go sit in the corner to think about their actions and what they have done. Virgo energy. This person is deciding that it is you that they want to fix this connection with. For some of you, we're getting through the multiple scenarios. Okay. Now, for a lot of you, you could have done everything that I said. Pull back, go to figure out what it is that you wanted. Someone withdrew from everybody. Everything shut down social media as well. Or just stop posting, stop giving. There is also snakes in the grass right here. They could have allowed someone to intervene on this connection, put a bug in their ear. Either way, they want to fix this what's we got usher that's what it's made for some of you are dealing with a libra usher is a libra what is will you ever make it a man will you ever make things right excuse me will you ever make things right for Taurus? from that person that is the page of swords they could be watching you 
So some of you are living your life. Some of you are looking good on social media. Or if you're not on social media, somehow they are seeing you. Could be telepathic communication. Okay. Some of you are sending telepathy or receiving telepathy. And you're wondering, are you going to step to me in the real world? Uh, are you going to show up where it matters? <laughs> Knight of Cups is a psychic and it also speaks of telepathic uh stuff they could be sending dreams and songs they could definitely be whispering sweet nothings to you some of you dating you being chivalrous opening up actually putting 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 that charm on and actually taking you seriously and communicating how they feel that communication could be at elementary school level okay some of you are wondering will they ever fix it will they ever communicate how they feel or open up to be emotionally available and vice versa, them feeling this way towards you. Some of you, you got cold. Or you could have cussed them out or said some spiteful things here. Okay? Someone could have had a child, too. Dating around. But anyways, this got something to do with what's going... Who's going to say what? So this could be a standoff. Who's going to communicate first? Who's going to open up first? Yeah, because it's, it's, it's starting to wait. Yeah, it's kind of a... Se it's a separation, ten of wands. Things are getting hard. Who's going to open up first or let their guard down to release the baggage between the two of you? I could be speaking past, present, future too. I am. I compare others to you for sure. Cards tried to come out sideways. Ace of Swords. So I spoke of it, meaning what I said was facts. <laughs> Ace of Swords. Okay, so I'm going to get a card. But what I said was they're dating around. They're starting to see the people that they are encountering is not you. Well, I compare others to you. For tourists. Stay ready. Or that, okay, I'm hearing that. Oh, oh, yeah. Eight of Pentacles. No one works as hard as you do. No one is as skilled as you. Okay, as skilled as you are, if you know what I mean. But, um... <laughs> No one is no one else is worth committing to or working together as a team or working towards something, building something with like they see that with you. They're decide they're starting to see that uh because on any other eight of pentacles, there's one guy working on this wall of pentacles. On this card, there's also someone in the background also working towards something. They're starting to see from a new perspective on the other side of this eight of pentacles that um you are someone worth working towards or building something with. Um, and they know the two of you could master it by working together. The two of swords, they could have been avoiding reluctant hesitance because this horse is here to say, are you going to get on here with a sword of action, a sword of truth, a sword of clarity? The horse is awaiting them to make a move to say something. This could be past energy for you because some definitely shocking troops came out. Scorpio energy into the light about how they feel, whatever blockages they had or whatever spell work was stopping this person from communicating with you has been balanced out for the Empress. Taurus and Libra energy, or oh, this is you. If you're a male, you're willing to do what it takes to communicate, be more consistent towards your person. But whip appeal is here by babyface. So again, someone is realizing that no one else is as skilled as you, if you know what I mean. I am recovering for Taurus. <laughs> We. This person is recovering from ooh being guarded, aloof, cold, cut off. Could have went through some child custody battles. They could definitely be someone into intelligence. The King of Swords is very analytical, judge like, judge, juror, and executed energy. Could work in police department or some kind of IT or uh, electronics or things like that. But there's a baby here behind his throne and there are two people looking like they are going through a court situation that could be child custody based on the illustration of this card they could have lost a child or uh have to be responsible for a child or uh could have had a child i spoke of over here on you could have gotten someone pregnant they could have hurt you hurt them or you're or you're healing for some of you um you could have gotten pregnant decided to keep or not to keep either way this shifted their world um drastically but for some of you i feel like this king of swords got guarded became cold and aloof this could be you if you a male watching you're learning to be more dominant more masculine more vocal more clear and direct about where you stand and how you feel 
And again, this is what a masculine is going through for you women. Okay, learning how to speak, how to communicate. But it has a lot to do with something they have experienced based on it being clarif clarifying a I am recovering card. All right. They could have went to jail as well. Okay, with the whole justice system with the King of Swords. I left you before you could leave me. Ooh, that flew out. They were serious about it too. World card. I said someone could have world card you. I said that shit. Okay, but I said it with this is the end. But anyways, here it is. Taurus, Scorpio, Leo, and Aquarius. Eight of Pentacles is Virgo energy again for some of you. But um, yeah, they closed the cycle out because they definitely did not want to be the one to get left. That's abandonment, trauma, issues, or they just were afraid to get hurt. Could have, which mean they were hurt before. Abandonment, trauma from a previous relationship. Or this is you. You ghosted, you pulled back. Um, because you didn't want to get hurt by this person, you were afraid to put yourself out there or afraid to let it get too deep, I'm hearing. The hermit is here with the world. Someone ghosted. Someone pulled back. Someone ran from the connection. Could be dealing with a twin flame running with, with me saying ran. But um, they just left it. World card. For a lot of you, because this is a multiple scenario, I feel like some of you have closed out toxic cycles in your life for someone i do feel that i feel that strongly some of you have d did what it did what needs to be done to close out toxicity toxic cycles so that you could be with someone okay just being near you is intoxicating Taurus. fell over i'm not ready the lovers Ooh, lots of lust like i thought it's a conflict, though, because it could be they are involved with another. Gemini energy is a choice between two. Okay, interesting. Five of Wands, Leo at the bottom of the deck, Ten of Swords, Gemini again, Six of Cups, Scorpio. Could have been hurt by someone from their past or they are betraying someone to a Pentacles, Capricorn energy, by juggling you and dealing with somebody or married to someone else. They're in a partnership or a union. They got kids with this person for some of you. Now, for a lot of you, this is a lot of lust. Every time you are around each other, the, the lovers represent lust. Okay, union, relationship as well. Partnership, monogamy, all that. Adam and Eve, yin and yang, twin flame. A couple that is divinely guided by angels. It's deep. But for some of you, it's a strong bond. For some of you, it's a choice between two in addition to that strong bond. All right. Why they need to heal at the bottom of the deck? Swords. Two of swords, reluctance, hesitance, avoidance, sneaky, deceptive, conniving, Aquarius and Libra energy. Okay. For some of you, your person has been flighty in and out, night of wands. They were definitely in lust. Okay. They were definitely moving off lust. That's all they wanted. Okay. I'm hearing. <laughs> Good dick and a cup of dollars for you women. Okay. Anyways, yikes. Somebody somebody got pregnant on that good dick and a cup of dollars too with the sun card Leo energy. Uh that has someone has become enlightened about who they are, the choices that they make as well. Someone's growing and evolving. So for some of you, this is past energy. But yes, they need to heal from mind games, playing mind games, stalemating holding you up, leading you on, okay, for some of you, just trying not, just trying to make sure that you don't move forward, but they don't, they have not taken a step with, it's time for me to heal, and then I don't know how to feel, but they do want you in their life, knight of wands, lovers, they don't want to let you go for some of you, and I have a lot of tourist clients and third parties. They don't want to let you go, but they don't want to do what it takes. Okay. Well, some of you, your person has healed from the stagnancy, the mind games, the player ways, the player days. For some of you, you're still here. I don't know how to feel over there at the bottom of the deck for tourists.
Lost Without You on the TV. Taurus Energy with the Hierophant Gang, North Node and Destiny. Some of you are very intuitive, a healer, a teacher. Some of you have your own business or organization. Some of you come out very structured. Okay, some of you, this is about upbringing. Okay, some of you want marriage, commitment, longevity. They don't know how to go about this. Some of them are married and they want to give you, or you're demanding an offer or they want to give you an offer. They don't know how to go about it. Some of you, this person sees marriage with you. When I compare others to you, Eight of Pentacles, that shit is intense. I don't know how to feel could be the energy. I don't know how to feel could be, I don't know what I want. I don't know how to feel could be because I actually have I don't know what I want in there. This is intense. This could definitely lead to marriage. This shit is stressing them out. You're a very healing person. You helped them to change, to evolve. You've, you've lit a spark under them. You somehow guided them, showed them a new way, a new life. Okay. That. You could be wanting a commitment too while they're in a connection. You could have asked for it or else could have given them an ultimatum. But they don't know how to move about that as well. Aquarius with the star. Okay. You could be, again, in a spotlight chosen a star. You could definitely have a great deal of wealth or your own business. Or you will. There's the devil right behind that, though. And the moon. Could be some moon magic trying to block a new beginning. Not going to get into that Capricorn with the devil. Some of you could have that placement. But or they could be bound and stuck to a karmic partner. Or have some traumas that they need to release, cut ties with, and heal from with the star. Before they could be able to know how to feel about this connection. You are the person of my dreams at the bottom of the day. They're not a cup shoulder. So you could be getting some telepathy from your person. You are the person of my dreams. Getting a FaceTime here. Somebody could uh, be getting ready to communicate with you. You could have walked away from them. Or they walked away from you. And that's when they realized that you are the one for them. For some of you, they're getting ready to do what needs to be done in order to be with you. Because they're realizing you are the person of their dreams. With I am afraid of commitment, that's that hair of fine ace of pentacles too. I don't know how to feel. That is scaring the shit out of them. All right. But uh, yeah, with the eight of cups, Pisces energy. You walked away and that's when they realized two of cups, it is you that they wanted to be with. With the monogamy, soulmate, twin flame, union uh, energy with the two of cups, cancer energy. This is the end for Taurus. king of pentacles sideways this king of pentacles is getting ready to break up with somebody or he's having financial issues or his financial issues are coming to an end queen of pentacles oh never mind queen of pentacles king of pentacles at the bottom of the deck some of you your masculine has refused to evolve for some of you this is you you definitely need to get back on board especially for you men okay there could be a relationship a situation a marriage or a commitment that's getting ready to come to a close that is the end on that five of pentacles someone's leaving a home they feel isolated alienated without you though you could have cut this person off or you need to cut someone off who's toxic or non-committal king of pentacles sideways some of them have financial issues they giving up okay eight of cups even though you're the person of, of, of their dreams they had to walk away because they married or some shit like that for some of you i feel empty without you for two four of swords oof i am recovering king of swords i feel empty without you first this could co be called dependency someone could need to heal when you are not there they don't know how to exist or this is you king of wands five of cups there could be some eight of swords there could be some emotional loss when it's time to go to sleep and lay down to be at rest that is when you when they're in idle time you're on their mind more okay some of you this person can't let you go and you are very healing to them the star card showed up your energy is peaceful they're at peace when you're there oh okay that's cute i am not ready in reverse six of pentacles now they're ready to give to you equally reciprocity moving forward two of wands but some of you, your person has done what it takes or is going to do what it takes, depending on where you are in your own timeline, to give to you equally. For some of you, they were giving to you and another. They weren't ready to let that go. One more for the Six of Pentacles. I'm not ready. They have been working on their finances. They are building their credit. They are able to get loans and stuff now. They were waiting on that because finances could have been an issue. 
Six of Pentacles, I'm not ready in reverse for Taurus. Three of Cups at the bottom of the deck. Some of you could be getting ready to reconcile. Libra energy with the Four of Swords and Taurus with the Six of Pentacles. Nine of Cups, oh shit. And the Hangman. They went within doing alienation, isolating, you two not speaking, being on bad times. And they see and they realize that it is you. That is their wish. Nine of Cups. Star card showed up, which is also a wish. Um... They want to give to you and they know that you would give back. They know this connection will be reciprocal. They were not giving equally for a lot of you. They were not ready, but it jumped out here and spent in reverse. For some of you, you may have to pull back until this person is realizing what they're missing. For the third party people, if you know your person's married or dealing with somebody else, no shade, just facts. They're not going to see what matters as long as you're there enabling them. So do what you got to do to pull back. I check on you from afar. Why is it sideways? I got cage bird. Yes, yeah, some of you that are in a three in a three party situations, the love triangles, the entanglements, you're caged up. It's time for you to fly. This person is holding you back. Okay, spirit say don't get too deep. Don't hurt nobody's feelings. But yes, cage bird, Alicia Keys. Look it up. I check on you from afar for you third party folk. That's a lot. Some of you are in the spotlight. Six of Wands, first card I saw. Ace of Wands, you got a lot of things going for yourself. You could be a speaker, a prophet with the Page of Wands. Ace of Wands, Four of Pentacles, you teach people how to let go of toxic cycles. King of Pentacles, or there could be someone who's married who's not letting you go. They text you every now and again. Y'all have sex, y'all link up. Not sure what that's, what that's about, but uh, <laughs> other than what I said. Six of Wands is public recognition. There's some of you are on a, on a stage or you do something that is very popular. Okay. Some of you are a spokesman for children or some kind of youth group or organization. You could definitely have some kind of nonprofit something going on as well. But again, some of you, this person is involved with another. They check on you when they can because someone's holding on to them. Four of Pentacles. They could have children. Okay. They come towards you when they can for a wise knight of knight of swords with the seven of pentacles because this queen of swords is always right there. Okay, for some of you with the third party situations. But for a lot of you, this king of pentacles is wanting to do something in your direction with the ace of wands, six of wands. They're not letting you go. They want to bring you some form of good news as well. For some of you, this is you for you, man. You have your eyes locked on a particular individual that you have not let go of. And you know a connection will be successful, balanced, and reciprocal with the Six of Pentacles, Six of Wands. But this is where your person stands today. Healing, figuring out what they want, learning what they want, learning what they wanted is no longer good. Cutting off shit. Some of you, this is the end because the situation is toxic. Again, not every tourist is a good person so or, or in healthy relationships. Some of us have had many karmic partners. But yes, your person is causing out cycles and so are you. Someone's realizing what it is that they want. Until next time, peace.